So we are off to see the wizard, wonderful Wizard of Oz. It is time to make sure that we are on our way. successfully made it to Philadelphia. In West Philadelphia, born and raised. That was quite a bumpy flight. <laughs> it was pretty intense. And heard this one talk all the way there. <laughs> I did talk all the way there. And this one slept all the way there. So I did not sleep. Yeah, he was snoring no, the whole he way. Did not. But on a good note, on a good note, I managed to find a charm for Yay! that one. I don't know how I saw it. This thing's like that big, like super tiny. Walking along and then all of a sudden, <laughs> bam, there it was. Right there. Right there. So, high five for you. Woo woo! Yeah. So we're at a staple here in Philly. Get a what? Philly cheese check. Philly cheese steak. An original Philly cheese steak. I have Tony no Luke's. idea. It's Tony Luke's. Tony Luke's. If you're ever in Philadelphia, get one. I am rocking my Boys Will Be Boys shirt. So if you can see, thank you, Philip DeFranco. Uh, I appreciate all that you do. Now, it was a very long day yesterday and it rained immensely. But as you can see, here on the boardwalk, ready to get this day rolling. One thing I don't understand is Atlantic City's business motto. Like, it just seems like it's a plethora of bad business decisions. Everything's either way overdone or not done enough. And there is no middle. Even down to, like, the little push carts. Instead of having a little bicycle behind them, the guy's actually pushing them. So, I just don't understand their mantra. It, uh, as a businessman myself, it doesn't make any sense. daily thing. This guy gets more phone calls than I know what to do with. But, right. Are we getting ice cream? Okay. I'd say that place there looks like it's got good ice cream. Let's try it. Let's check it out. Here we go.
We're the Blue Crew. Blue Crew. That's right. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Thank you.